And on this Labor Day, local unions and leaders are coming together to support essential workers. Right now, a rally is being held in Point Loma. You can see that video here. CVS workers trying to negotiate a new contract, but a deal has not yet been reached. News 8's Chris Grow is joining us live from Point Loma to explain what they're asking for. Oh, and they're still there. Good morning, Chris. And they want a new collective bargaining agreement and with that some added benefits. Now we just heard from San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria as well as council member Dr. Jennifer Campbell. So they've got support, but they're mostly making their voices heard too. So people going in and out of this CVS will hear their calls, and this is essentially what they want. Higher wages, better staffing, improved safety standards, and better security at their stores. Now, we spoke with one CVS employee and a union member who tells us that they've been working nonstop during the pandemic. In fact, he told us he just got done working two doubles and doesn't feel he's being fairly compensated for filling in when they're short staffing. Plus, he feels he and other employees were exposed daily to COVID-19 during the pandemic because they couldn't just work from home. They had to be at the store in order for it to run. They want CVS to use the money that they've made during the past 18 months and to reinvest it in their workers. We have been trying to negotiate with CVS now for several months. After this pandemic, after we've all gone to work for the last 18 months and put ourselves at risk, and they have come back and said they are not going to give us a fair wage, they're not going to give us uh, affordable health care, even though they are a health care company. And so we're holding this rally to show them that we mean business. And we did reach out to a spokesperson from CBS. However, we haven't heard back at this hour. It's important to point out it is Labor Day after all. Reporting in Point Loma, I'm Chris Grove for News 8.